Hey guys, that darned inspector again. Wanted to talk to you about damp proofing. I have two photos here, both from the same job, taken on different dates. Uh, this is my first inspection. Uh, CMU wall they erected to support a new fireplace. And this is the attempt at damp proofing that I found. Um, Damp proofing is only required when you're enclosing interior spaces. Now the way this is set up it looks like they were going to suspend a slab there and have usable space underneath it. Um, when you damp proof a CMU wall, you cannot apply this uh, lumberyard roofing cement directly to the block. Um, you have to parge the wall first with Portland cement and then you can apply this over that. Uh, they also make a specialized coating that's made to go directly onto block. Uh, I've never seen it used. I don't think it's widely available. It is out there. If you want to spend the money for that, that's fine. But if you are going to use the products that are routinely available, you have to parge it with Portland cement first. Um, of course, now that this is on there, it would be extremely difficult to put uh, Portland on top of this. Uh, so the solution was um, don't break a hole through the existing foundation wall here and make this usable space. Fill it up, pour the slab, and be done with it. So this is the first inspection. I explained to the contractor you know, how to apply the damp proofing. Uh, this is my second inspection. Um, the contractor has the parging correct and he has the damp proofing correct. Um, the problem is, well, it's not a problem, but it wasn't required on this wall. Um, this is a garage, they're going to fill it up with sand, pour a slab. It's not enclosing any interior spaces, so it's not necessary to damp proof this wall. If he wants to do it, that's fine, but obviously it was a waste of time and money. Um, so those are the two things you got to remember with damp proofing. Number one, if you're damp proofing CMU block walls, you can't put the roofing tar right onto the block. You got to parge it with Portland cement first. If it's a concrete wall, it's fine. You can apply the stuff directly to the concrete wall. Second thing is you only have to damp proof when the walls are enclosing an interior space. Here are the sections you need to know. Again, uh, International Code Council makes these available online, so you can uh, Google for it and look it up yourself, or you can print this out. Alright, thanks for watching.